Okay, look. So I do got this one thing that I found out. Yeah. I don't got too much information, but it's what I discovered, which was kind of weird, right? Yeah. So, right? So what I saw, have you heard of the torso and the Thames? The heck is that? And I think it's Thames or Tombs, right? Whatever, right? Yeah. So on September 2, 21, 2001, right? Yeah. I think in a sewage line, a body came out yeah. of a young black boy. Yeah. No arms, no head, no legs. Straight torso with, I think, girl clothes, like orange girl clothes. But it was a dude. It was a boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So they're like, what the fuck? How yeah. this little boy with no arms and all this shit come out, right? And what I think what they discovered was in his body, it was like stuffed and all of this shit. Like if someone did like a ritual on the boy. Really? Yeah, right? And there was like no no traces of like who it could be, right? Yeah. Crazy as fuck, right? So imagine you just find a torso. Like they like A little boy. Like they like like sacrificed them or something? Yeah, like and they stuffed them with stuff and all that, right? Yeah. And they couldn't find like who he was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think like a year or two later, they supposedly have a photo of the boy. Yeah. But they 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 can't seem to find who's related to him and all of that shit. Like he has no family. Yeah. That's weird. So it was so weird for for the people to find it because like it's like bro, who 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 is this boy? And we had this supposedly one picture, but they don't know who it is. They don't know who his family is. Do they don't even know his name? Yeah, they came up with a name, but at the, at the end of the day, they don't really know. They they just speculation. Oh okay. So you're finding a little boy with no limbs. And just stuff with just bullshit, bro. Really? Like he got sacrificed. So they don't know still to this day. And it's still undis and it's still undiscovered to this day, bro. You know, I'm glad I, I'm glad you're talking about this because I was I remember I was looking up on the internet. I was looking up some stuff to talk about for the podcast, and I came across this one conspiracy that there's like an under there's like a undercover underground like cult that is kidnapping people and sacrificing them. I think that happens and. That's funny, right? How we just found out not too long ago, the Jews have an underground. Oh my gosh! Underground like, uh, facility, facility bullshit that they're running, that is uh, illegal. Yeah, because like this is what they said. They say that they're I don't know they're like Satanists or they're there's some type of cult that they're like kidnapping kids, kidnapping people, and like think about it like this, right? They say they're underground, right? So they're doing all this underground, undercover stuff. They're going through, like, creating tunnels. If you look up the map of, like, the missing people in the world, like, in the United States, it lines up exactly to the freaking uh, cave system in the United States. Look, this is this is supposedly the boy. And that's his body? That they said. This is, they said that's how they found it. Nah, that's crazy. Came bro. out of the sewer. Nothing, bro. But, like, think about it, bro. So imagine, right? Like I said, there's freaking like all the missing people that went missing, like everybody. They all if you they made a map of it and it lines up exactly to the cave system in the United States. So imagine there's like a cult that's like taking people and bringing them there, like sacrificing them. I feel like there's low key like a cave system. It depends on what state. I feel like there's a cave system connected to states. There is, bro. Like think about like, it. Like the catacombs. Yeah, because you gotta think about it. Like. Where do, where do all these cults be having their meetings? They have their meetings in the woods. Where do these people go missing? They go missing in the woods, bro. Bro, like, I, I really think we have catacombs somewhere in the U.S. I don't like know. Like, a famous one, bro. Because there's no fucking way. Like, they literally said, one of the, I, think it was, I think it was Paris, right? Yeah. They do rituals in that shit. Oh, yeah, the freaking catacombs down so, there, bro? There I'm might be sure. some down there. Bro, why do people do rituals? Like, what the fuck is the whole point of that shit, bro? It's those people that believe in other BS, so they think this is what's the right thing. But mm -hmm. like, yo, and it's like, it's actually kind of crazy because, I, yo, I was watching another video and they said that like Halloween is like one of the worst times for like all that stuff because like the week before Halloween, that's where the most like homeless people go missing. Because they're getting them ready for the Halloween decoration. Bro, they say they freaking, oh my God, that's kind of crazy. Bro, they say they pick them up and like sacrifice them. That's why and, the lot... And the police ain't gonna do shit because they don't give a fuck. The homeless bro, they, nigga, bro, it's like a freaking. It's all some. They all in on it, bro. Bro, and you know, I, yo, you know, what I, you know what I heard about the Jewish people, bro. They, yo, there was a book, right? There was a book created. It was like I forgot what it's called. It was like the Book of Zion or whatever, and it basically talked about how the Jewish people were going to take over the world. 
And it was a book. They don't know who wrote the book, but it was basically think of it like as a Jewish Bible. But it was basically Jewish Bible. It was basically showing how the Jewish people are trying to take over the world, right? And they got their plans written. And guess who that that book was given to? All the Nazis. And that's why they was going through doing all that stuff to Jewish people. Now get this. Oh. Now, so are you saying that that original that what originally what the Nazis were doing is what the Jews were planning to do to people? Supposedly, that's why that's like that was what was in the book. Like there was like talking about world domination, like how they're the more superior religion, how they're the most superior people, and they want to take over things. And I guess like they that's what. The, that book was given to the Nazis to like, you know, this is why that we're doing this to the Jewish people. Just to like, I guess like fuel them up. But you got to think about it like this now, right? You know, the Jewish people own all the land around here. Think of, think about it, bro. How many Jewish people do you see in school? None. And, but you, they live in union. Sure, that shit make no sense to me. Bro. They live in union, bro. Well, they go to their, well, they, they be in their own world. They go to their own school. Exactly. They walk around when you're sleeping. Exactly. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just thought about it. They don't. And our block. Well, it's just block mainly. Yes, they're all Jewish. Them motherfuckers be up at 10 a.m. Just strolling at night with a whole family. Yes. They don't drive. If you're Jewish and you watch that, I have love for you. I oh, got yeah, nothing. No, it's no, just, nothing. It's what? just these Jews I've seen. Just what I've seen. This is just conspiracy. Not talking shit. I'm just saying i seen these Jews walk around at like 10, 11, just with their babies, just mm -hmm. walking. I'm like, like, and you know what's also who walks around around this time really with their family? I can see you walking by yourself, but with the whole family really? The, bro, I remember I was driving to go pick up Jay some sushi like the other day. And I think that's when the, the synagogue got out. I'm talking about everybody. They have, bro, they have, you know how they have that little Jewish hat? They have a little umbrella that goes on top. So they don't wear, they don't use umbrellas. They have that thing on it. Bro, at least 50 of them. But like, think about it like this, right? 50, what time was this? It had to be like 10.30. Yo, what the f- And you seen them all leave the building? No, I didn't see them leave. They was walking by Washington. And how many? You said like 50? At least it was a good amount. It was I'm a lot crying. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm crying. Bro. I'm gonna be scared. But now think about it like this, right? Like I said, in that book, they're, they're basically show, saying that the Jewish people are trying to take over the world. Now think about it. I was watching Michael. You know Michael Rappaport? The, uh, the white guy that always talks smack about everybody? I think so, yeah. He's Jewish. You know how many people that we know? You know how many people in the world that you didn't know was Jewish? Adam Adam Silver is Jewish. Adam Silver, Adam Sandler. No, the 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 commissioner to the NBA. He is Jewish. The ball, the ball motherfucker. The ball dude is Jewish. He's Jewish. He's Jewish. Michael Rapport's Jewish. Who else is Jewish? Fucking. But now think about Aiden. Aiden, Aiden is Jewish. <laughs> now think about it though. What is, these all people got so much money. You know who owns like the buildings and these little apartment complexes they're making? Jews. Bro, they own. They're owning everything. They're literally taking over the world. They own that giant mall in in Sea Caucus. The Jewish I people own that. Mall. How they getting their money? I think, it's just, get, I think it's just family, family like foundation wealth, bro. But like, where are they getting this bread from? They don't like we don't. They don't go to our schools. Where do they work? Exactly. You don't see no Jews working in a regular convenience store. They, <laughs> bro. I don't see no Jews working in a restaurant. I don't see a Jew working in a, in uh, in a mall. I don't see a Jew working in a hospital. I, that's where are they getting this bread from. You know what's crazy? I thought about because in my in my cause I, I, I work in the ER, right? Yeah. You know Jews don't accept blood. Yeah, they don't. Yeah, yeah, they don't accept blood. They don't. So maybe maybe that's why they don't like bro. So they, do they even believe in like? The, well, they do believe in the hospital stuff, but I feel like, bro, it's just weird. I feel like Jews don't really even work in the hospital in the medical field really like where are they getting this bread from they get money from real estate but like where are they getting the, the ability to buy all this land I don't know bro, it's, bro. Just, it's just I think it's generational wealth like, but they, where are they getting the generational wealth from is what I'm trying to say from their families but they just ran it up on people bro I'm just saying what if Hitler was right it's like nah I'm not gonna say <laughs> thing is crazy bro. No, 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 don't say it I'm not saying bro, that bro 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 Hitler took their plan yeah I know Hitler was trying to take over the freaking world he bro. took like you just said they had a book Nazis got it Hitler probably said ooh <laughs> say, oh, I'm, 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 I'm gonna do this I'm gonna capitalize I'm gonna capitalize on this shit now hey, bro. man I don't know I just think I, Jewish people like I love Jewish people you know I feel like I don't I don't have hate nobody I don't really discriminate nobody but it is a little fishy the way they move about their lives bro